So here we have on the bottom inserting the SIM card. I have my SIM card but it is not a Nano so I would need to convert it to the Nano. The router and the SIM is from the STC and I'm not sure that if it will support other SIMs if you bought it is like a contracted or under a trademark of it's like STC or some other service provider. But let's see. So we have our SIM card. We're going to insert it. Oh, it's still not Nano so I have it to do some micro so I have it to one more shot to convert it to the Nano. Now my SIM card is converted to the Nano SIM and supposedly is according to the size you see we will insert it on this way that show us the direct shows us the direction so here we go I hope so I am doing things correct and let me use a new sim injector yeah it seems to be nicely installed and now it's time for us to power up our device and let's see how it's look like and how things work connected power it is powering up and we have here six leds power Wi-Fi network signal and these two I'm not sure these two are for what but let's see how it work and I hope we should have some information about the SSD and the password of this device um, let's see I will go to my computer and let's see Wi-Fi network let's see our available network what is the name of this SSID still its network still not caught and it's green it means we need some configuration it's powered up pretty well I will do configuration and we will get back like this So as we see our router is still booting up it is booted and surprisingly it has two SSID so that you will have a two Wi-Fi network for a single router that's interesting and let's see I see it cannot connect to this device let me try to connect the second one and there we go let's see I'm still not able to connect there may be some issue with the router connectivity as I see all the signal are disappeared here the router is still booting up perhaps either I need to do a configuration for it uh, or I will check if there's any other issue let's see what we could do